Good evening, this is Rabbi Wallstein with a very, very important message to Klai the, col- the current challenges Klai Yisrael faces needed our immediate attention and require a course of action that is somewhat unique. You may have heard about the ongoing WZC, which stands for the World Zionist Congress elections. It is clear that its results will impact Yiddishkeit and the whole of Klai Yisrael. Here in America and also in Eretz Yisrael. That is why we must unite, put aside our differences and vote Torah from Sinai.com. The first challenge we're going to face is in Eretz Yisrael, where the reform movement is looking to increase their influence and presence, seek to take over marriage, divorce, and conversion. This can lead to potential issues of mamzeris, chas v'shalom, and not, of not even being to identify who is a yid and who is not. If that is not enough, they are at rock Klai Yisrael as, as wicked ones, the Palestinians, as the victims, and support the right to return fully, understanding that it would give the Palestinians a majority vote and control of Eretz Yisrael. In other words, if, um, if they would give them the total vote and bring them into the land of Eretz Yisrael, we'd be outnumbered and they would be able to vote their own cassette and uh, it would not be good for us. The second problem is in the United States. This really involves the reform conservative and the general left liberals, which is virtually anti-Semitic and anti Eretz Yisrael. Anti-Semitism, as everyone knows, is growing at an alarming rate in the United States. The incidents of violence and graffiti, you see that it's happening all over Beis Akvaros, um, is not even the tip of the iceberg. There are reliable studies and simple math that show one million college students per year are taking college courses in which the course material as well as the instructors are pro-BDS, pro-Palestinian, anti-Israel, and anti-Semitic content and authorship. So what are we going to do? First, we're going to dominate Hashem. That's number one. Second, the answer to these challenges must come from a group that has the understanding and the clout to effect change. We must support. It's a group called Torah from Sinai. The name tell the name tells half the reason. Yahadus, I write there, it's Israel, and the reason why many thousands gave their lives was based on the message that Torah from Sinai represents. The other reason is that Torah from Sinai had a high level meetings with the people in the Likud party, and therefore the ZOA, Zionist Organization, and have agreement regarding these issues, which means that when the World Zionist Organization tells its vote, you're going to Torah from Sinai.com and voting Slate 11. Okay, so if you want, you go to Torah, T-O-R-A-H, from F-R-O-M, Sinai, S-I-N-A-I, dot com, and voting Slate 11, Torah Voice is heard, and the coalition demanding the very issues raised by me are addressed by a group with enough clout to make the difference. Go to TorahFromSinai.com and spend $7.50 or less. Some are $5, some are $7.50. A few minutes of your time and vote and forward this to your family and friends and urge them in the strongest terms. Lech Kanais Kal Yehudim, it's Purim time. And get all the Jews together. Again, go to the website TorahFromSinai.com. And uh, with Shem, we'll have a Thank you.